90s. Chad, you're not gonna believe it. I just finished the most incredible game of all time. Is it bad? It's super bad. Whoa. Well, come on, man, let's see it. It's called Final Fantasy VII. You play as a badass soldier who goes up against an evil corporation that's trying to suck the planet dry of- Whoa, who's this guy? Oh, that's Barrett. He's super cool. He's the leader of the Avalanche Resistance Group, and he's got a gun for an arm. Oh, what about this guy? Ooh, Vincent Valentine, the sexy brooding vampire. Nice. What about this girl? No one, just no one special, really. <laughs> she dies, doesn't she? What? No, her, she totally is alive. Okay, great. <laughs> the 90s. Oh man, this Final Fantasy III game is so tight. The story's epic, the steampunk aesthetic is killer, and there's a whole opera scene. Mm-hmm. Man, there's nothing like this on my Sega. Well, buddy, sorry to say, but you're just playing out of luck. If you want the righteously radical RPG goodness that is Final Fantasy, you gotta go with Nintendo. They're a classic pairing, like peanut butter and jelly, Oreos and milk, Lunchables, and Capri Suns. Yep, Final Fantasy and Nintendo are gonna be together for a long time. <laughs> What's a PlayStation? 90s! Dude, I love Final Fantasy, but I wish you could take it on the go with me. Dude! You can! Dude! Check it out, dude! It's the Final Fantasy Legend! For Game Boy! Dude! Nope! 90s! Oh, hey bro, what's up? Just wanted to bring back your copy of Final Fantasy VIII. Oh, so soon? That was fast. What'd you think of it? Honestly, dude, I didn't finish it. Wow! <sighs> Why? Couldn't get into it. The story's really convoluted. It didn't really make any sense. Convoluted? What are you talking about? It makes perfect sense. You play a band of teenagers who all happen to go to the same mercenary high school and the evil sorcerers they're fighting turns out to be not only the wife of the principal, but also the one who ran the orphanage that you all grew up in but totally forgot about because of the Guardian Forces. Now, Guardian Forces... Two hours later... And in the end, after you defeat Ultimessia in the time compression, you end up back in the past where you plant the figurative seed of the literal seed into the head of your sorcerer's principal in the first place. I gotta stop letting out this game. The 90s! Come on, man. Final Fantasy VII is obviously the best one. No, uh Final Fantasy III is the best. What? Seven's got 3D graphics. Graphics schmafics. Three's got a better story, better music, a train you can suplex. Three's so old my grandma played it. Seven's got real drama, cooler action, Tifa's boobs. Tifa's boobs look like squares. You look like squares. Guys, guys, calm down. There's no reason to fight about this. Both games are unique and excel in their own ways. Besides, everybody knows that Final Fantasy Tactics is the best one. <laughs> <laughs> but it has the best story! <laughs> you can unlock Cloud! Nineties! <sighs> wow. What a great game. I know, man. It's just... Just a great time to be alive. I know, right? Things have been so great since the Cold War ended. The economy's been growing at an unprecedented rate with no signs of stopping. New countries are joining the EU. All major nations are generally at peace. I mean, Russia's our friend now. That's crazy. Yeah, and the vice president is starting to look into that global warming thing, so that'll finally get solved. Plus, it just seems like the old prejudices of the past regarding race and sexuality are finally starting to die out. If things keep up at this rate, just imagine how great the world's gonna be when we're adults. I know, right? We're gonna have it so easy. <laughs> hey everybody, Odin from the Warp Zone here. Thank you so much for watching. If you wanna check out another cool video, hit the box down here. If you wanna join our community of patrons, 
hit the box up here. All right, and I am out of here. I'm still here, aren't I? Really thought that was gonna work. Okay, okay.